introducing our new programmable toroidal winding machine GWH5 by TDM Company India Private Limited. The machine with its new easy to use control unit is aimed for winding transformers from minimum final ID 80 mm, final OD of 430 mm and final height 175 mm. Using this machine copper wire with gauge 0.8 mm to 4.7 mm could be easily wound. The power consumption of the machine is 2.3 kW, operating voltage is 230V 50Hz and the current rating of the machine is 10A. The main motor in this machine for winding is 3-phase AC, 2.25 kW with a speed 1400rpm. The co-rotation motor is stepper with a torque of 125kg/cm. The maximum winding speed of the machine is 150 turns per minute. The main parts of the machine are GWH5 winding head, magazine and ring gear, roller table, machine base and intelligent control unit. A brief introduction to the parts, winding head. The main parts are copper guider, copper tensioner which has an adjustable screw to adjust the tension on the copper wire, cutter to cut copper wire, copper guiders. The brake assembly which consists of brake shoe, brake lever, brake adjustment screw. This lever here is used to break and unbreak the magazine. The brake shoe holds the magazine intact on braking. This handle is used to rotate the ring gear to adjust position of ring gear. This lock here on the ring gear needs to be pressed and pulled outwards to open the ring gear door. These are three rollers used to hold core. These two rollers are rotated by means of stepper motor and this is freely moving roller. These handles are used to adjust the roller inward and outward as per OD of core. Locking this lock, we can place the core to position and unlock to remove it. This handle is used to adjust movable roller inward and outward to lock the core properly. The machine can be moved using the wheels provided under the base. After properly positioning the machine, it is fixed to float by using this lever. By rotating it in clockwise direction through this core till the wheels rise up. The machine base houses the electronics and motor for running the machine. Here you can see the power switch and the red knob for emergency stop. In the rear side of the machine base, the copper guider which guides the copper properly to the winding head, exhaust fan, MCB, power cord socket, pipe in connector for the foot pedal, two levers to adjust the height of the control unit. Moving to the control unit, this is the control unit, uh, 4x4 keypad, 1x4 keypad, LCD and speed control knob. To operate the winding machine, first we need to place the core. For placing the core to the roller table, we have to rotate the magazine and ring gear with the wheel provided, so that the door of the magazine and the open segment of the ring gear are in line with the opening of the gear head. Then place the core open the magazine door, opening the sliding arm of the roller arm by opening the side lock using this lever. Place the core and close the door of the magazine. Close the sliding arm of the roller table and ensure that the lock falls in the right position and the core is properly placed. Now guide the copper wire to the magazine to the copper guider to the copper tensioner cutter and guider. Now hook the wire to the holes in the magazine. Engage the magazine to the gear rack by inserting the lock in the copper guide slot. Next step is to engage the magazine to the gear rack by inserting the lock in the copper guide slot here. Then program the machine using the switches in the control panel. We need to enter a label. 
press enter the OD ID height the copper diameter number of turns direction clockwise or anti clockwise angle for sector winding press next the display shows load turns and count if it is to be edited press edit otherwise press next for loading Now we start loading the copper wire to the magazine by pressing load. The loading speed can be increased or decreased using speed control. When count equals the load turns, loading stops, displaying set speed control to zero. Once the loading process is over, cut the balanced copper wire using the cutter provided. After that, release the lock of the magazine so that the magazine is deleaned from the ring gear. Now apply brake to the magazine. To start winding, press wind in the control panel. We can see the count increments. Speed of winding can be increased or decreased by using the speed control. When count equals to the number of turns, the winding stops. Now release the brake after winding and cut the balance copper wire. After the last turn, then remove the other end.